Welcome to the Open Dental webinar on creating claims. Today I'd like to cover three topics. The first is how to create a claim for a single patient. Second, how to send claims. And third, how to find procedures not billed to insurance. First off, how to create a claim for a single patient. If I have a patient for whom I would wish to send out a claim, go to their account module. Once there, notice that they have procedures that have a status of unsent. Unsent means that those procedures have not been attached to a claim and been sent. I can highlight the procedures that I wish to send out. Now, there's a new claim button up here at the top. Just to the right of it has a drop down arrow. If I click that, I have different options for creating claims. The other option here at the bottom, you would use for patients that have three or more insurance plans. Medical claims can be sent out inside of Open Dental. However, there is some setup required to use this feature. Please refer to the link to our web manual page in the description below. Normally though, all I need to do is just click on the new claims button. That'll bring up our edit claim window. Here I can review the information. I can see the billing provider, the treating provider. The billing provider is generally the default practice billing provider. The treating provider is the provider on the last procedure on the claim, which is not flagged as a secondary provider. If I click OK, the claim will show up in the ledger as a red entry. If I have a patient with dual insurance, creating the claim is basically the same in, as a patient with single insurance. I'll come up here to the new claim button. generate the claim. This time when I click OK, you'll notice that there are two entries in the ledger, one for the primary, one for the secondary. The primary is going to have a status of waiting to send, and the secondary claim will have a status of hold until the primary is received. How to send claims. When I'm in the edit claims window, there are three ways to send the claim off. One, if I click the OK button here at the bottom right, this will batch the claim and I can send it at a later date. In the middle, I have a send button. If I click the send button, the claim will immediately be sent out to the clearinghouse. Just to the left of that, I have the preview and the print buttons. If I click the preview button, I can preview a printed version of the claim. I can print this up and mail it. If you don't want a preview, you can just hit the print button and print the claim up. If I've batched the claim, I'm going to go to the manage module and then the same send claims button. I may have to specify the clinic. This will bring up a listing of all of the claims that are waiting to be sent. From here, I can select an individual claim, or I can select multiple claims. If I click the Send eClaims button, that will send these claims out to the clearinghouse. This window will do some other things for me. I can preview claims. I can create a blank claim form. I can print the claim. I can print labels of the insurance companies so that I can put them on envelopes for mailing. I can send the claims out electronically. I can validate the claims to see if there's any missing information on them. I can
can get reports from other clearinghouses, refresh the screen, or find procedures not billed to insurance. If you receive an error when attempting to send a claim, see the missing data error when sending claims webinar linked in the description below. Lastly, how to find procedures not billed to insurance. If you're in the insurance claims window here, if you click the procedures not billed, you may have to specify a date range and a clinic. If I click refresh, I can see I can find procedures that have not yet been billed to insurance. If I highlight these, I can automatically create claims for them. Once I create a claim for them, I will still have to send them out in the insurance claims window. You can also find procedures not billed to insurance by going to the reports. If I go to reports and standard, in the monthly section, procedures not billed to insurance. If I click on that report, it pulls up the same window as before. Here I can enter a date range, specify a clinic if I need to, click refresh, find any procedures that have not yet been billed out to insurance. So to review, in this webinar we've talked about how to create a claim for a single patient, how to send claims, and how to find procedures not billed to insurance. Thank you and have a good day. Thank you for joining us for today's webinar. If you have additional questions, please call our support line at 503-363-5432 or access our complete online manual at opendental.com. And to make sure you're staying up to date on our latest training videos, make sure you subscribe to our channel and turn on notifications.